Okay. Excuse me, start talking. There's a bubble in my throat. Good evening. Hello. Hi. Welcome. Uh, it's a bonus stream tonight, but that's okay. We're just going to continue on with our Deus Ex uh, Mankind Divided playthrough. Uh, I wonder if I can get through Gulag. That'd be nice. Um, because, like, this whole game is depressing, but, like, oof, this game, extra depressing. Alright. Let's just get things started. <laughs> good evening, Pokemon Freak. That's a good pun. More like Deus Extra Stream. That's very good. Mm hmm. Ah, oh, the loads times in this game. Like a small object you find in your surroundings can be thrown to pull a guard's attention away from where you want to go. I've literally never done that. My solution to guards is always just knocking them the hell out. I'm sure that won't have any repercussions. <clears throat> where was I? Oh right, yes, yes, yes. Going on, but on the line. I just didn't kill you. Welcome back. Yeah, yeah. Is there anything in your shop I wanted? Of course. <laughs> I don't believe there was anything that really did it for me. Right. Sell that, I guess. Wow, that's just a lot. Just a lot. Jesus. That was ready to roll last night. Yeah. All right. Nothing interests you. No. I'll be on my way. As you wish. Hope to see me again. You should not really hope that. All things considered. Uh, okay, so I can go that way. I think I want to talk to this Lumos guy just just for the. He kicks it. Lubos. Okay, so where's Lubos? I'll find him watching an elevator on the first floor of the market. Where am I right now? So... Okay, can I go up from here? That's going down. Whoa, that... Uh... Uh... Um... <laughs> this is fun. I wonder if I can utilize this somehow. Well, that was silly. <laughs> okay. It's a cool looking shark, though. Gotta say. I like that. Hold on a second. Let's just get this screenshot out of the way. I really like that. Cover prompts, objective locators, reticle, uh, radar. I'm not crouching and have. Well, let's do this. Cool. Nope, not gamepad. Gameplay. There we go. love how they're like, they give people to basically be able to turn everything off and just play this game au naturel. But they make it so damned awkward to do. Uh, okay, let's see if we can find an elevator. That looks like an elevator there, right? Oh, maybe first floor, actually, okay, yeah. You're Lubo, aren't you? Yeah, okay. Um, uh, just before we do that... Where was... What's her face? She was down here, right? Yeah. Oh, hello. Ebook. Oh, uh, yeah, we read that one. Okay. I've changed my mind. I'm going to buy those multi-tools. 
My favorite brooding stranger returns. Come to see what entity has for you, or did you just meet me? This lady comes on strong. Show me what you've got. Well, if you're going to make it sound... Uh, yeah. Who knows? Just good to have. Good looks and blah blah blah. Not leave I'm wasting time chit chatting. I've got an elevator to talk my way onto. It'd be fun if it actually forced me to have to remember the phrase. <laughs> nice helmet, bud. You're Lubosh, right? Dushin Sokol told me Ark might have the answers I'm looking for. He sent me to you. Dushin? I heard the police had him and his brother Tibor locked up in the Narrows. Yeah, the cops were working Dushin over pretty good when I found him. Wasn't exactly a fair fight, so I stepped in. Is he okay? He'll be fine. Looking forward to sleeping in his own bed tonight. Not a lot of people in here would be bothered to stop and help out a stranger. What was happening wasn't right. You took on the police by yourself on their own turf, and then Dushin pointed me to you. <laughs> I like how this guy's trying to like talk us up, and I'm just like, I don't care. Please, let's get to the point. More some wisdom, maybe. Uh oh, it is actually going to. Ah, I appreciate that the game actually wanted me to remember this. When you've robbed a man of everything, he's no longer in your power. He's free again. Spoken like a true brother of the revolution. I think I even heard conviction in your voice. I'll unlock the elevator for you. Go on. Uh, if you heard that, that's shocking to me, because I didn't hear anything. <laughs> what can you tell me about Talos? First time I met him, he's cutting a bullet out of me while trying to explain the history of the Gulag. He has his hand stuck in my leg, and he's encouraging me to study Stalinist labor camps. Three months later, I pass him in the throat, and he says, Lubosh, how's the leg? Are you studying the Gulag like I suggested? Remembered me like it was yesterday. Sounds like he has a good memory. No, I matter to him. Me, a nobody, matter to a great man like Talos Rucker. That's the kind of man he is. Or he has a very good memory. How did you get involved with Ark? I used to load freight for the Czech Railway in Ostrava. After the incident, my employers were afraid of me. I was fired. So like most of the augmented in the country, I drifted into Prague, unlicensed and homeless. The police swept me up in a sewer raid one night, put a round in my leg and dumped me here. It wasn't long before Talos found me. And he gave you work? He gave me purpose. He's the reason I'm still alive. All right. Dushin said some of the police are using the Ruzika bombing as an excuse to hurt the augmented in Gollum City. Why do you Wait, are there non-augmented people in Gollum City? From Talos to get Ark to fight back. Violence begets violence. That's right. And if Ark responds violently, then their case against us only builds. But <laughs> Talos is too smart. He won't allow Ark to be baited into a false confession. Even oh yeah, the cops. <laughs> right. I don't... I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I count the cops. I know they're here, but like, I don't really count them because they're not really of the population, right? They're they're kind of separate Great, thanks. from the population and, you know, the way that... Uh, yeah, call the elevator. Yeah, I did say people. I don't think these cops really qualify, quite honestly. Uh, alright, so... I guess to the throat? What a weird name to call a thing. Why would you call it that, I wonder? <laughs> Look at all these wires. God, it's just an electrical nightmare up in this place, huh? Before we do that, oh, that brings us up to here. Well, before we do that, whoop. all right. 
If there's free stuff in here, I'm gonna take it. Whoa, what? Hey, no. What do you got in here? Bullets and machine pistol. Eh. Alright, back up we go. I still prefer the way I got, did it. I didn't sneak in, I talked to the guy. Everything above board. Oh, hello. Patrolling the market, just like you said it would be. I got it, brothers. Now, let's see what we've got here. These little guys can be tricky. Every once in a while, one of them will go off, even if you. <laughs> Should have tried cutting the blue wire. If only life was that simple. You are lost. Wowzer. It looks like you might have taken the wrong turn. Ooh. You must be. Oh, he has many eyeballs. No. I am Marchenko. And Marchenko. He is more of a guardian. Like the hound at the gates of hell. Oh, there's a weird lighting thing going on here that's making everything like rifty. A big day. What a man reads can tell you more about him than his face. Can I give you a little friendly advice? Yeah, sure, bud. Sure. <laughs> I do appreciate that. His the eye line uh, from uh, Jensen. <laughs> he's like he's. Ugh. How do you figure that? You don't know me. I know this place up ahead. We call it the throat. And sometimes those get cut, yes? When outsiders come wandering in where they should not. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'll take my chances. I just want to see where Ark hides out. We are not hiding from anyone. Tell that to the cops down below. Do not listen to police and all their bullshit about Ark. Those Shluputia freaks are everywhere. Breaking heads, making their mess. And we have to deal with it. Better watch yourself. They won't go easy on you either. Leash or no leash. Uh, I'm not saying that one. That sounds very stupid to say. Not looking to get in the middle. Eh, or I could sympathize. I like sidestepping. I don't think Jetson really wants to get into this. And come through untouched, yes. He has eyes, but he cannot see. Yeah, sir. It's not my fight. It will be. One day soon. But for you, I think understanding will come too late. And then, no amount of fleshy hardware is going to keep you. Oh man, you got boxers here and everything. You will end up spare parts in some harvester yard. Meet on a butcher block. But not you. You're gonna go down swinging. Take them all with you. We won't be the ones who fall, brother. What you're talking about? That's terrorism. Easy. I thought we were just two men having a conversation, <laughs> discussing the issues of the day. Like your friend Rucker? I see him on the net. He feel the same way you do? Ah, yes. Talos. He is a good man. Strong, intelligent, principled. You could learn a lot from him. Yeah, it's a little judgy, but okay. I admit, he's got a way about him. He talks and people listen. But is that enough? He is no politician, if that is what you mean. Rucker gave up an easy life for our cause. He lives the struggle, just like the rest of us. Mm. I respect anyone with principles, but in my experience, that doesn't get you much when the storm comes down. Well, as much as a political debate stimulates me, you are pushing my patience, and I have work to do. You have had your warning. Get out of here. 
Well, you still can. If that was your recruitment speech, I gotta tell you, it sucked. <laughs> the way I see it, after the bombing, tide's turning against you. Ark has made itself public enemy number one. <laughs> yes, it may seem that way. For now. Ooh. Until then. Sergey. Be careful in that shire. Huh? Nasty rumors of a wrench getting scratches on his finish will scare the tourists away. Ah. Yes. We'll be seeing you. That's a big man. Chicane, patch me through the miller. I should probably hold for that. Patch you through. What am I, your fucking secretary now? Jensen, I got you back on track. I am. But I need you to run a name through Ilank. Victor Marchenko. Got a feeling about this guy. Fine. But remember, you're there for Rucker. If he's behind these attacks, everyone else will fall in line. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Totally, totally, totally. Now, excuse me for a minute. You guys got a whole bunch of video game consoles. That's good. Everyone needs entertainment. Okay, that seems to where we want to go. Not doing that yet. This also brings us to the same spot. Okay. These guys, I came from here, right? Like this is where I was. Okay, okay so that's the throat there. All right, cool. Wow, obvious lighting differential there. Run around. Don't have the thing for that. <laughs> Ooh, I don't know where the hell this thing is. All the way down there. Hmm. Alright. That's not a good start. Trace program initiated. Oh my god. Access granted. Alright. Seems useful. Uh, Art call, new bridge code from Max. Take me yet? Yet another email about the code change. Walk across the bridge without being cut in half. Don't forget to deactivate the lasers. The code is 3354. Okay. Cool. Sure. Sure. I don't need the Typhoon ammo yet, but I will do it. Something back there? There does seem to be something back there. Hello. Uh, why can't I? There we go. Cool. No. Sure. Tactical shotgun. Is the tactical shotgun better, I wonder, than the machine pistol? I don't know. Okay. 
extremely secure. <laughs> In this universe, LastPass was never created. People were too, uh, too wacky, wavy, uh, played old Lunar Man happy for, um, for augmentations. No one ever stopped to think of a password, uh, protection. Oh, hello. Hold on. How do I get down there? Oh boy. There's a window there. Seemingly no way to get down to it. I mean, I could just drop? See where this takes me? Right. Yeah. So I see this thing. Oh, that was a credits? Oh. All right. That's a lot of water. Uh, how do I get back up there? I just walk up this? Uh, uh, nope. There we go. Uh, there was a thing here, right? Yeah. Can I do this? this? Yeah, there we go. Three, three, five, four. Uh, deploy. Alright. Pretty straightforward. Okay. So I can do that. I mean, there's all this other stuff I could explore. Like, I've called the elevator, so can I just, like, goof around a little now? I don't know, actually. So, like this. I guess it's the alternate way up if you don't have the, uh, the password that I just unlocked, right? Ooh, ooh. Oh, okay. So I can make a bridge. Gotcha. Anything kind of cool over there? That looks like a place I can visit. That looks like a something, right? You can get to it from over there. Over here? This thing? Okay. Yeah, hello. Wait, what? Alright. 
Let's just go see if we can see what the heck whatever's up there is. Mind you, maybe the elevator just takes me up there. I don't know. What easy way? Oh wow, this is dark. Okay. I assume the elevator is going to take me up there. Ah, oh, good evening, Taser. You're talking about me. I hope it was good things. This game must be maddening to play for a completionist. Yes. Uh, yes, it is. So I'm hoping this is just going to take me up to, like, wherever the heck that one pathway was. It did not. I wanted to check out all that, whatever the heck's down there. Uh, well, maybe I can just leap down like a jackass. See now. Whoop. <laughs> that shouldn't have worked. Uh, well, <laughs> you haven't been to my stream in a while. I mean, it feels like it has been a bit of a grip, but yeah, we all got our things going on. I mean, my stream variety is actually depleting right now because, um. That. Whoa. Okay. Cool. Good thing I've got that can't fall to debt my death thing. Or else that would have been unfortunate. Um. Oh, look at this. Because I'm gonna be having a kid soon, so I'm just trying to get through my last couple of games before that happens. Because once I have my child, new child, my stream is just going to get wrecked in terms of any kind of. Just another battle rifle. Just a plethora of battle rifles. Uh, I would like to get down, please. I didn't... I did not consent to being on this shelf. There we go. Uh, yes? Um, so yeah, I'm trying to get through the kind of, like, the games on my list before... Oh, that's not what I wanted. Okay. Uh... Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Uh, oh, what's this button do? Button is garbage. I need your stupid button. I'll just do what I did last time. Quite literally, exactly what I did last time. <laughs> uh... And I went over here. Fun practice at this now. I know what I'm doing. And then up. And then on to here. Okay. Oop, no, just sprint. And woo! Call this elevator back down. I wish I could figure out the actual way to get up there. Probably has something to do with this contraption, but I'm not willing to do it. We'll just do what I did last time, except pay a little more attention to where I'm going. So, went like this, then I looked over here, there we go. Now I had gone down this way, and then I looked at something in a wall and I was like, oh, what's that? And then fell to my death, my, not death, thankfully, this time. Alright. 
Hello, someone's apartment. This is a long way to go just for this. I wonder if I just find, like, place settings. Like, knife, fork, candle, all set out. Stained paper plate. Oof. Just, just a lot of beans. No, peas? Yeah, sweet peas. Alright. Oh, there's got to be something, like, interesting in here, right? Surely. Oh, like that. Like a tranquilizer <laughs> rifle. And machine pistol. Okay. Interesting. I can't use this particular shower. Hello. The thing, just on the other side of this wall. Do I complete every game I play? Um, as in make it to the end screen? Yes. Um, I have decided I don't really have it in me to 100% every game that I play. But yes, I do try and complete every game that I play. I mean, I paid for it. Um, except in cases where I didn't, <laughs> I guess. Um, but games that I pay for, I generally have decided that I want to play that game, so... Okay, another... Woof. Okay, it's a weird room. Cool, hacking software. You know, that thing that's totally normal to find in a room like this. This line? Yeah, uh, no, that's not. I didn't want that. <sighs> but yeah, I do try and, like, to be fair, this is a game that I've had on my want to play list for, like, a real long time. Uh, I just did not have the hardware with which to play it. So, uh, what was that? This one? Yeah, discard that. Okay. So, this is one of those instances where it's like, I, I absolutely wanted to. Ugh. Yeah, this is absolutely like the alternate method of getting up and down this place. Okay, so... Oh, up. Oh, that's fun. There's probably all kinds of weird crap along this wall that I didn't even know about. Okay, okay. Let's do a little more exploring, shall we? like for me here. Can I go down? Nope. Can I go up? Oh, I can go up though. Alright. Nope. Okay. I guess I understand what that useless button was for now. Everything's so messy. What's this? Hollow site? Yeah, alright. Am 
money, pain meds. Anything else in here for me? Nope. This is a hollow site too. Just a crappy site. Slightly improves the weapons accuracy. Helps counter up the okay. Got the, I don't know. Can this can machine pistol even have a forex scope? That seems pretty redundant, right? I feel like the ho the hollow site is actually probably a better addition for this thing. Yeah, let's just do that. Boop, boop, boop. I guess maybe outside of that door. That matters. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Chicane, I'm in Ark territory now. A flyby show you anything? This section seems to be a mass storage area. View our head, looks like Ark has repurposed it for living quarters. Or barracks, maybe. Those two things have very different connotations, Chicane. <laughs> well, everyone in front of you is armed, so I'll let you decide. Right. There's a good mark something back there. Get it? Get it? Nope. Oh my god. Oh my god. Like a ghost. The hell is everyone? I don't like how distinctly quiet it is in here. Like, where are the mobs? Oh, there we go. Calm down. Don't tell me to. Don't tell me to calm down. Then they. They, they, they try to intimidate me. Get me to bring them here. But I refuse. Hey, Tibble. Oh, in their bowl. They, they are coming here. The police know what happened to that one down there. Not the police. Interpol. I, I, I think they mean to arrest Talos. Relax, Coco. If Interpol needs to learn the same lesson we taught the police, we will be glad to do so. We will go to any lengths to protect Talos. Okay. Now go. Go keep your eyes open, and we will handle Interpol together. Sigh. Hey, what happened to your jacket, Jensen? Whoop. Okay. Okay. <laughs> they never asked for this, yeah. Wait, do I actually have a... There we go. Yes! Yes, I do. Okay, can you stop being so suspicious of me? It makes sense that he would never stop being suspicious, but still, it's irritating. Is there an alternate way up there? I don't actually think that there is. Oops. Another one of those panels, but I don't know what they do or how to open them. Oh my god, is he still suspicious? Is he just perpetually suspicious now? Oh no, there we go. Okay. That just took a lot longer than I expected. Okay, what do we got? <sighs> Alternate road up there. Room that I probably want to look into there. Yeah, 
Yeah, my assumption is that they're robot sentries. Because they're doors that can definitely open, but I can't interact with them in any way, so... That's usually what that means. Okay, so... That dude's in that room. Alright, well... Why don't we... Hey, Tibble. Jackass. I'd love to be able to talk to him. Oh, there we go. So go. Boje. It's you, I I'm Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I want to interrogate him. We came to you in good faith, with good intentions, and asked for your help. When you backed out, I defended you, and this is how you repay me? Why? You're right. It's true. But I... I... I have no choice. Can you keep my family safe? Can you guarantee that? No, of course not. So, I do what I think is right, and if it costs me my life, at least I have done that. Can you say that? <laughs> I'm here to get answers and find out who's behind the bombing. I want to make but this man feel like shit. I can protect your family and a lot more like it. All you've done is put more families in jeopardy. You're right. I know it. Just, just go. Do what you came to do before I change my mind. Oh. I will go right after I steal everything on your table that I want to look at. Yeah, I already did that. He's a crap. Talk about having convictions. Shh. No moral spine. What's that noise? Why are these on just little rotators? He deserves a sleeping. Yeah, but I don't know what'll happen if I sleep him. Oh, hello, Fox Secretary. I'm tossing around shit into the book room again. Uh... Okay, so we got door code for the library. That's a way up and over. Too many sounds in this place. Let's just be quick about it. Oh boy. We're just gonna. <laughs> cool legs, though. Like power blade things. Okay. Oh, there's a person way the heck over there. Okay. Just leaving a combat rifle sitting around? Jesus. Sloppy. Ooh, hello. You like stealing stuff. Could be a pocket secretary down there, though. Yeah, you shouldn't trust him. He's a dink. There's two guys there, right? Are you guys gonna have a conversation, or what's, what's your beef here? Did I see you reading an email from your wife the other day? Yes, 
Every Sunday she send me one, and I answer back. My sons are doing well at the next school. Nobody knows their father is an old. When she asks about your wife, do you tell her what's going on around here? Ah, I used to tell her that... Okay, this will trigger the guys to finish talking and come around the corner. Progress. Lately, though, she doesn't ask anymore. There we go. He'll leave. Uh, which means I can now... Do this. Where are you? Do 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 Money. Okay. Is this guy gonna come back into this room? I wonder. It would kind of make sense that that would be his patrol route. Oh, there's a camera right there. Good thing I pretty quick saved. We're doing all that. Okay, okay, there's a security cam just right. <clears throat> security cameras can th see through windows. Who knew? <laughs> it was an extremely smooth takedown. Um, unfortunately, it just had a better follow through. What can I say? Nobody knows their father is an old. When she asks about your life, do you tell her what's going on? I wonder what that thing is. Uh, I used to tell her that things were difficult. But we were making progress. Lately, though, she doesn't ask anymore. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So. Closed. Hey, bud. Come here. Okay. So, was it this one? Nope. 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 There it is. Okay, so that guy's gonna come back into this room. The security thing's right there, so I should be able to turn that camera off. Uh, okay. Okay. We'll just see what his patrol route is for a second here. He comes in, looks out the window, and I think Crawler just walks it back out, but we'll see. Huh? Yeah. Never drink in Pluno again. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay, the camera. Alright. Oh. Let's just do this real quick, yeah? Alright. Now, we can wait for that guy to come back. What does this do? What is this? Oh, just throw a defibrillator. Alright. That's... Oh, wait, whoa, there's a window right there. I forgot about that. What the hell? Okay, so now... Let's move that out of the way so I don't knock it over. Okay, now... Still working my way through the living quarters. Picking out a place for you and the missus. <laughs> I could see it now. You settling down. 
Going in great rusty yes. beard. Raising a few toasters. Should take her out on the road, she can. What's that? You're cutting out. Uh huh. Oh wait, what am I doing? Uh, exit this. Yeah, it's fine. That's a level three. I should probably, you know, try not to get busted right away. What was that noise? That whoosh whoosh thing. Access granted. I don't know what that was. Okay, yeah, we got a code for the security gate. Oh, an email from Talos. Gentlemen, I know it's been a difficult and trying time, but that's no excuse for the crass sensationalism in last week's video address. The members of ARC here and around the world expect the best from me, and I give it. We are not Pikus, we are a force for truth. In the future, I expect more vigorous and efficient fact checking. Extra care to my microphone placement. There was a lot of proximity noise for the, for the Lavier microphone you used. And complete and total elimination of any and all jump cuts. We have three cameras. If you feel the need to edit out some dead space, please cut to camera two or three in the future. I appreciate your uh, questions and attention to these notes. All right, brothers. Uh, everything is urgent. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, and that's a real long email that I think I've read before. Yoink. And. Uh, yink. Then, let's not do that. Pretty sure I should just be able to go like value. Yes. Just skip all of the downstairs stuff. I'm sorry, is that an exercise ball? It is! Where's what here? Well, it just lets me drop down. Whoop. Okay. These stairs are gonna put me where? Oh, there's the door there. Oh, that is actually the better option. Okay. And we're gonna do that. Now that we've evaluated the scene. Uh, where was that hole in the ground? Over here. Yeah. I see a grade over there. This is like... Who is watching here? Where are they? Oh, right there. That person. Okay. Okay, so I guess we just go through the window and it's gonna be fine? As much fun as walking through the front door would probably be. Oh, hello. Wink. Boop. You'd sit in that desk. Uh, okay. So, yeah, I don't know how I would have dealt with that. I guess I could just F1 through there, but... Sure. Man, once I get my stabilized dogs, I'm still getting that Tesla thing. Chicane, you with me? 
can't fully know. What's your progress? I'm through the living quarters. <laughs> That's cute. Looks like I'm into some kind of operations area now. If my gut tells me Rucker's gonna be above all this, someplace high, indefensible. Better find an elevator then. I'll update you with extraction coordinates when I have them. Chicane out. He can hear me if I hop over. Whoop. Okay, no, but apparently he can hear me take one step. I could have just hopped through the window, I guess, but it's fine. What? news oh, not that one garbage can don't knock that over enter see where you guys are going. I mean, up seems like the obvious thing here. Let's see what you do. Person's not looking anywhere. Nothing on this level of OP. Haven't heard from the other areas yet. You're just walking back and forth here, so I should be able to go like this. Well, I sure hope you only have one path. I'm gonna look stupid. That's my battery we're taking. Okay. I thought that was a... Uh... Oof. And the takedowns in this game are just brutal. Uh, oh, there's a vent way the heck up there. goes. I know. Where does this take me? Where's this? Uh. What the f What the fuck? I just jump towards it and try and ow 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 no 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 okay that hurt a little but I've got like stupid amounts of healing stuff so whatever uh, 
and come back here? What am I even doing with my life? Oh, this is just a total other way of getting... To, ugh, okay. I thought that'd be some cool, like, little puzzle thing or whatever. Hmm. Nope, it was just an alternate way to get up to here. Alright. Um... little look around here. This is the, yeah, the print shop. Bombs. They keep giving me battle rifles and that's super concerning to me. Huge. What if we did blow up Ruby? Do you think Talos would allow that? Probably not, no. But do you ever get the feeling that someone else is pulling the strings around here? You know what? Oh, there's a camera there. I did not know that. Alright. Whoa, hi. Wait, what? Where the hell did you guys come from? No intruders on this level of operation. There will be heat from all sides. Still counts. No e things. I'm glad they have offices here. Up, 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 up. Okay, still in that cone, huh? Whoever bombed the Ezekiel is probably a religious fanatic. Just leaping over this is actually the better option. We have lost already. These people think our people. Piss off. Here with 
Arch will be blamed for Rudika. Whoop, that's a person coming straight in here. Where is the camera catch you? There's an ebook. Can't not read an ebook. The Inconvenient Og by Telsarker. Chapter 17. One future for all humanity. In the nanotechnological future discussed in previous chapters lies a lesson for all of us, in that nanotechnology will enhance human capability, tapping into our limitless and magnificent potential. I wonder why they always say limitless. Or we have limits. The human mind is the greatest computational device the world has ever experienced, not only in the impressive reach of our rational and deductive abilities, but also in our capacity for less empirical concepts, such as love. Love is infinite, hope is infinite, and understanding is also infinite. Well, when we apply to the problem of the augmentation divide, our boundless capacity for empathy with our fellow human beings, the seemingly insurmountable intricacies of the situation cannot help but be revealed for the minuscule challenges they are, with solutions both simple and obvious. We have but to open our minds and our hearts and we will be made manifest. Uh-huh. Okay, okay, back out. Okay. I wish I could find the security office of this place. I think it might be that room, now that I look at it. Oh, Ooh. We are being trained. Alright. There's a camera where? Oops. Okay. I have a great idea for a man okay. Yeah, that's a letter about Tibble. Just take me. Oh, hello. Oh, hello, person. I'm not operating the boom again. My shoulder is fucked. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Oh, good, he didn't fall. Oh, another hall site. Cool. I hope this campaign brings some change. Just a beer? Hmm. Software, a nuke, it's up here, crank ammo. Is there anything else useful for me in this place? Nope, just a dude straight below us. I'm like so far removed from where I need to be. <laughs> hey, bud, you're gonna walk around a little. Are you the only one in here, though? Look at the window. Say hi to the camera. Another dude, but he's on the other side of the wall, so he doesn't count. Just gonna wait for him to come back. All right, here he comes. No, no. 
Take the mine template for now. Over there. Oh, this just brings me all the way over here. Ah, I thought there was gonna be something more in here. I'm so disappointed. Brings me to the other side of that. Ooh, what's this? All right. Well, that's not what I wanted out of that. I was looking for like a security room or something. This seems like the more straightforward thing. Leave. Uh, okay. If I believe, I believe. This window doesn't have as much people looking. There's that camera there. that camera. I can't see it. Let's see. I'm going to step out into the open here. Okay, don't have a password for that, so i got to wait for this guy to come back around. I really feel like getting busted by a patroller while I try and crack this door. Ugh. It's a door with two people in the room, which is not great. Wait, do I have the multi-takedown? Did I invest in that yet? I did! Gotta wait for that guy to come back. He's taking his sweet, sweet time. There we go. I think that's him walking around there. Yeah, well, there we go. Alright. So there's apparently no camera here. I think it's actually on the floor below. Why aren't you coming all the way around? Oh, son of a... Alright, fine. Uh... Serious. Are they both below me as well? Fragment. I don't need that. Oh, somebody can see me over there. Oh, this is the library. I thought I had the code for the library. Okay, so what jerkwad can see me over here? When I stood up, someone could very clearly see me. I have a great idea for an oh. 
That's not what I wanted. Anything on this desk I care even remotely about? No. Nope. Fantastic. This computer here. Okay. Okay, so this dude. Oh, there's lasers there. That's what that's for. Okay. So going the other way allows me to skip all the lasers. Still gonna put down this guy if I can. On how far he walks. Yikes. Just lay on, cool. That dude right there. You know what? I think it's time we try this out. Huh. That worked like super well. <laughs> In the old game, there was a like a delay when you shot someone with a tranquil, they'd start running around like a re uh, like a really um, what's the word I want to use for this? Like really cartoonishly, like bah! they'd run around with their arms in the air, going bah! and then just like stop and tilt over. Um, I'm glad they've adjusted that. Check with their head cut off. Thank you. That's a much better way of saying it than really cartoonishly, which is, I mean, it's a descriptor, but it's not very good. Okay. Oh. Oh, who can see me there? Man, that guy's got some vision on him. Can I just say? Oh, multi-tool. That's actually pretty good. Uh, a locked terminal. And pocket secretary. Uh, oh, I got a password. Is it for this? Yeah, it is. Uh... Okay, weird memory. Okay. We got another password to another computer. Cool. That's that. No. No, this is a weird place to store your wine. But the humidity levels alone are just going to be the worst. So... There's the one guy way the heck over there. There's a bunch of people. In here. Uh, oh, okay, that's a turret. That's worse. God, I wish I'd found that security terminal. The 
hell is everyone? So... Ow, level five. Or oh, hello. Yes. No. Uh, yes. No. Grenade launcher frags. Another battle rifle. Oh boy, do I have concerns. I have some boss battle concerns. Ugh. <laughs> well, this game, I'm playing it stealthily. You do not have to play this game stealthily. You can absolutely uh, come at this game um, with an entirely different approach. Let me put it that way. Um, but in the first game, I don't know if you played a Pokemon Pre, but in the first game, uh, the boss fights were made by a Whoa, what, what can see me? Who can see me? Is there a dude just staring out that window or something? What's going on? Can I do anything about this? I can... <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. I can just grab a turret? I'm... I don't even know... I don't... Okay. <laughs> Alright. Sure. Why not? Oh, you heard that. I'll never be satisfied. Hey, what the I wanted to knock him out, but it just didn't give it to me. So. Crafting parts. Concussion grenade, sure. Oh, good. The password. Auto complete. Uh, co op, Victor's PC. Okay, special task. Okay, so Buddy Boy's gonna start, uh, Going against the boss. I mean, a slight uh, difference in opinion, I guess you could say. How to do things. Didn't want the shotgun. I want to look at this guy. Another battle rifle. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, we got a door for something. Storm Surge! 
We need to discuss our original agreement for the party favors I supplied you. Turns out it's not like moving shit through Eastern Europe. There was more trouble than I thought. Which means I'm going to have to renegotiate my original quote. Balls in your court, but I wouldn't wait too long. There are a lot of other people who would gladly take the, your shit off my hands. Uh-huh. Uh... Okay. Uh, okay. So, Buddy Boy's doing some stuff that's not on the up and up. Okay. Ah, the frames have returned, huh? No. Well, we're back to no rhyme and reason between them. Alright, I'm just going up an elevator for now. Oh, I holstered my gun. Interesting. Okay. We'll just wait for a minute. There's a definitely a security camera just right there, huh? Okay. Uh, you know what? I'll just go to the washroom. I'll be right back. Right. Glasses. There we go. And then. Okay. Okay, so there's a camera there. I don't think I can get around it. Okay, doesn't seem to care. Oh, I see. It's a plot camera. Uh, looking at my Twitch page, needs a bit of updating. Oh, what's up with the? What did I do? I'm sure you'll understand if I don't take your word for it. You're clearly very skilled. I want to thank you for holding yourself in check for so very long. My friends only want to protect me, but there's been too much bloodshed already. You don't seem surprised to see me. I'm not. After the train station oh, attacks, I knew you're right. I'm not. Of time before they send someone, please. 
This isn't a social call, Rucker. I'm here to take you in. Our mandate is to fight for the rights of the Augmenta. Communicate our message, offer assistance. The Ark is non-violent. Oof, you've been through some stuff, huh? Alright, then this should be easy. Come with me, answer our questions, and we'll have you back here in plenty of time to film your next sermon. I'm not a fool. If I surrender now, I'm never coming back. Once you have me, you intend to make me disappear. But I will not make Sojourner's mistake. My people and I will resist you. I thought you were a pacifist. I am. But I'm more than a leader. I am a symbol. That is why you wish to elude. Well, you think pretty high of yourself there, bud. If martyrdom is the only way to remain a symbol, then even my death is preferable to my evaporation. If I have to bring you in by force, I will. And your people will try to stop me. And neither of us wants anyone to get hurt, so come along peacefully. You have my word. I will do everything I can to see that you are treated fairly. You cannot speak to me of peace or fairness. Not when your masters hide in the shadows, manipulating, controlling, murdering without the courage to proclaim their convictions in front of the rest of the world. Hmm. Alpha. Come off it, Rucker. You've been preaching pacifism for years from your ivory tower. Now all of a sudden your convictions are really being tested, and you're tossing them away. No, that's... Let me explain. The augmented peoples of the world have been stripped of their power. There are so few allies remain. The cause needs people like me to stem the tide of hatred before all humanity drowns in it. Mm-hmm. You're lecturing me about the state of Albrechts. I get the same looks. I go through the same checkpoints. And things are getting worse, so your plan obviously isn't working. I know. And it tears at me. I have been trying desperately to think of a better way. But so far, nothing. This is a very precarious time for the new leader. These attacks are making everything worse for us. My leadership position within Ark is being threatened, and I suspect the two might even be connected. Please, go back to your people. Tell them to give me 48 hours so I can attempt to resolve the internal conflict. Yeah, bud. You will be absolutely toasted if you do that. Hmm. Sorry, I think I hear a child. I don't like the patronize option on this one. The justify is true. If I leave empty handed, they will just send somebody else who will absolutely just murder this dude. I think maybe, yeah, just doing everything out in the open. If the terrorism is causing you internal problems, demonstrate your strength of character to Ark and to everyone else by surrendering willingly. Stand by your convictions. 
and you'll turn people to your side. But the cabal in the shadows, the ones pulling your strings and those of many others, they will never take my side. Can you understand this? If you were to take me to a new kingdom, you would be responsible for more than my death. You would be responsible for my effacement, the ruination of the Augmented Reds Coalition, and the perversion of everything it stands for. The bottom line hasn't changed. If you come with me willingly, there won't be any violence. You now have the choice. Choose the non-violent path, or you are the one betraying the cause. I... cannot watch any more of my people die. Not on my account. You have asked me to trust you, and so... Cool. Before we leave together, there's something I must show you. I suspect there is a power struggle brewing within our organization. Some people inside Ark are less committed to our ideals. Are you trying to mm -hmm. tell me you know who's responsible for the bombings? I have only suspicions, and until recently not even that. The evidence I have begun collecting is meager, but I give it to you. This is the key card from the security door. The evidence is inside. Why give it to me? Hmm? Why not keep it, present it at your interrogation? Because if my suspicions are correct, you got an achievement for that, whatever it was. I'm leaving here with you willingly. I may not survive to present my evidence. Somewhere down there, hiding in plain sight, is your real terrorist. I was trying secretly to find out who is responsible. Rucker. Uh oh. You just cut his arm off. Cut his arm off. Uh oh. Oh, wow. Chicane, Rucker is dead. Come again. I'll fill you in when I see you, which is where exactly? There's some greenhouses near your position. Below them is a clearing. That's where I'll be. Chicane out. Huh. Huh. Um, I don't think he committed suicide there, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. Um, I think something happened there. Well, ebook time. You think he committed suicide? Hmm. It was only during my tenure as a patient in the augmentation wing of the Buenos Aires Hospital that I truly became aware of the fascinating range of possibilities offered by augmentation technology. I served uh, Vincent San Frontiers uh, proudly for two more years to repay them for all they had done for me, but for most of that period my passion had already shifted elsewhere. I had enjoyed the enormous good fortune of meeting Hayden Seong personally when he opened Zimbabwe's first clinic, and so after my time in MSF it seemed only natural that I should join Lim International. At first, I concentrated primarily on the ways augmentation uh, technology could improve the lives of the impoverished and the downtrodden. But already, in those relatively early days, prejudice was spreading, and so my duties soon expanded to include campaigning for lower neuropathy costs and rising, or raising awareness of the anti-AUG sentiment. Or discrimination, sorry. Spread that one. Spread that one.
Yeah, I don't... Uh, yeah, he could have just committed suicide via the drink. That's certainly possible, but... I don't know. Can I inspect the drink? We're absolutely going to have to go and fight that beefcake. I'm looking forward to that. Thank you. Uh, this is from some person. Okay. Uh, cool. Safe Harbor initiative. Okay. All right. Yep. So, whatever proof he's got is in here. Okay. Okay. Can't get into that yet. Uh, I do appreciate that everything in here is non-lethal. Uh, the Inconvenient Aug by Talos Parker, Chapter 2. Hope and Uplift. Potential Unrealized. At the time when Hugh Darrow and his team were perfecting uh, PDOT technology, then route to redefining the very face of humanity as we knew it, a fundamental mistake was committed, with only the most noblest of intentions, which, as we came to understand the ramifications of this new technology, proved to be the very exemplar of damning by definition. They called the resulting prosthetics augmentations. In a very short while, the weighted term became the discussion, embraced by those who sought out the technology for their own purposes, and rejected with equal passion by those who opposed it. In the process, the, so the social discourse lost all perspective of the myriad uses of augmentation technology in medicine, the awe-inspiring depth and breadth of what we could accomplish if the governments, societies, and medical communities of the world would only capitalize on augmentation technology's staggering possibilities. Ooh, absinthe. Fancy schmancy. Uh, okay, so... I keep forgetting I have this menu. Hmm, level 5 doors take a while, huh? Yeah, I mean, there could have been something in his drink. I guess the question is, did he put it in there or not? That's, that's kind of the main question. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, ooh. School of Medicine. Is that the same thing three times? Anything else in this room? Oh, this one. This one. Oh, that's not great. Oh, hold on. There is an alternate a exit. Dude's arguing on the other side of the door. I don't think I want to go through that door. Gonna be honest. Oh, don't come in here. Don't come in here. What? What? He could see me? Hmm. Hmm. I call shenanigans.
Wait, what? What? How is he seeing me? I'm legitimately confused as to how that man is seeing me. What? Despite our dedication to the peaceful advance of our cause. I'm going in. Despite the fact that some of our own were killed in the attack. Oh, he can see the broken thing. Find out. Oh, that robot's looking now. You don't want none of this, robot. I have bullets for you. I'm kind of impressed you guys have vegetables growing, to be honest. A dude, like, right there. Two dudes. Oh, there's a lot of you. Oh boy. Mm-hmm. These cops are cowards. You'd have understood. Uh-oh. We are the front line. Uh-oh. Be a hero. Oh boy. Does he really think they're coming in here? Cannot let Dalos's killer escape. Oh, sneaky. Come out on the right track. Waste of time, Michel. Finding him will not bring Talos back. Good. Keep moving. Wait, so they already know Talos is dead? What? Okay. Does he really think they're coming in here? He's not now that he's figured out where he's supposed to go. There. Come out on the right track. All across the top. Cannot let Talos's killer escape. All right, I'm with you. I got nothing. <laughs> Find 
finding you will not bring Talos back. Keep passing. Let's walk across this singular board. This is fine. It's clear. But am I the only one scared here? <laughs> am I the only one scared here? No. Really, really, really don't like. Can I just go down? Oh, yeah, right there. Oh, hold on. So this was that entrance. Where do I gotta go? All the way down to level one. Okay. Level two. Hey, that skipped a whole bunch of stuff, huh? Okay, not that much, admittedly. Oh, wow. That was a heck of a find. Person above me, right? Need to stay sharp. Where did it all go wrong, for Christ's sake? Conversation over. I see a button. That's probably the elevator down. Is there just the one guy patrolling down here? Let's find out. Come on. No. That was the wrong button. Yep. Running. 
Where the hell are you? I'm on my way, she said. Well, step it up. <laughs> the slowest door. This would be panic inducing if I hadn't knocked everyone out. Searchable. I feel robbed. Oh, gee, wow. This doesn't look like I'm walking into an arena at all. Ugh, so don't want a boss fight. I hate boss fights. Especially in a game like this, it just doesn't make sense. There we go. Oh, okay. And... Yep. Yeah, and you're the loot new leader of Ark. Oh please. Uh giant beef boy there is like He's so stoked for that. That's the best thing that could have happened for him. He now runs the show, and now Ark can become violent. <laughs> Pokemon Freak, that's very good. He is now the Ark villain. Uh. Very good. Very good indeed. Now to get chewed out by my superior officer. A lot of goddamn good Rucker being dead is going to do for us. Your orders were to bring him in. I fully intended to. Then how did this happen? Let's see. Mm. Yeah, look at how many people I've killed. Um, I don't think it's time to confront boss yet. I think someone being paid to manipulate Ark killed him. Someone in his crew. Rucker told me Ark was being set up, but the real terrorists were hiding in plain sight. And was he wearing a tinfoil hat when he said this? The man was devoted to bridging the divide between Augs and Naturals. He knew that every one of these attacks just drives the stake in deeper, and that the only way to fix things was to pull that stake out. He said he had evidence to prove Ark's innocence. He was ready to come in and talk to us, even though he knew it meant risking his life. What evidence was he referring to? Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, <laughs> who do we trust? Hmm. I don't know how much. Uh, Vega, I believe, is um, that woman we met in the limb clinic. 
the other augmented operative former bell tower, etc., etc. Hmm. This is one of those things where I wish I knew how the story would diverge from this point. Oh, you're making a joke. I mean, it was, it was, yeah, that one was all right. I don't know what to do here. I don't really trust my boss, but I also, he seems like too obvious to be the bad guy, you know? I think he's getting led around by the nose as much as anything. Or someone's got something on him to make him kind of have to follow that direction. I want to Google this, but I don't want to Google it. Oh yeah, if, if that's what I'm saying. Like, I don't think he's actually the bad guy here. I think his boss, or his boss's boss, is. Um, yeah, the Juggernaut Collective, we know nothing about them. And the, the, the problem with them is, like, we don't know anything about them. They're supposedly the good guys, but are they? I don't know. You're in favor of screwing the authorities? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know. He was killed before he could say. Well, then. There's no use theorizing over what ifs, is there? What about Victor Marchenko? Oh, what was it here, bud? I ran that name through iLink and got back a blank page. Why? You got something else? Nothing more than a gut feeling, so far. Well, I'm sorry, Agent, but I need more than that. Christ. What a mess. You know word of Rucker's death is going to spread, don't you? And when that happens, the head of state police assures me Golem City will become a war zone. We can't let that happen. I hope we're good on juice, Chicane, because I need a ride. As for you, Agent... I still have a case to solve, and I know exactly where to start, Director. Smiley's had more than enough time to analyze that DSD I gave him. The one you took from Ruzika? I'll check in with him, see what's on it. After that, I'll go where the evidence takes me. I intend to make sure the right people are brought to justice for this. Whether they're augmented or not. Get a move on. Before this case gets any colder. And keep me in the loop. Let's go, Chicane. Mm-hmm. Oh, that was very fast. So fast I couldn't even look at it. Oh, there you go. Rucker was the voice of the augmented. People loved him for it. Oh, when word of this hits, Private's gonna explode. And the whole world's watching. Listen, Miller's gone to meet with state police. Could be our chance to determine his loyalties. He lives near TF-29. You want us to search his apartment? Not us. Me. You keep digging into that Versa-like break-in. And see what the Collective can dig up on a Victor Marchenko. If I'm right, and Rucker was poisoned, all three might be connected. Jensen out. Adam, you there? You're not gonna believe this. Adam Orloff was in Prague. You're kidding. I wish I were. Six months ago, he got an augmented expert's visa. He's been coming and going periodically ever since. Border control logged him in this morning. I arrived in Prague six months ago. Where is he staying? In the Lilioma Courtyard Apartments on Lavani Street, second floor. I'll check it out. Anything else you want to throw at me, game? I have seven Ugh, I have so many Praxis kit right now, but I want to get these things resolved because I want to upgrade a bunch of them. Mind you, if I do this... I can knock a bunch of people out with that. Cool. Uh, map. 
It'd be a real shame if he'd already turned his apartment over. Yeah. Okay, so that's right up there. Why don't we do that first? Ah. It is all our boss, Corelli. I have another delicate matter that requires your expertise. I thought we were even, Otar. We will be even when I say so, my friend. Oh, sweetie. Now then, to business. You will meet Mrs. Cadillac, the owner of the Red Queen. I understand she has a problem, a problem named Dominic. Let's get this straight. I'm not a cleaner for the Diwalis. Why don't you send one of your own? Because I am telling you to do it. I don't mention killing. Just meet with Cadillac and find your manners. She's a powerful woman. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. We got another code or something. I assume it's this one? Nope, alright. Uh, that decision keeps playing dividends. Yeah. Yeah. Him telling me to do things because he told me to do it is a very good way to get him and his entire crew um, unmade. Okay. Wait, what? I love a mic. How do I get to you? Trace program initiated. Access denied. Okay, that was just irritating. Yeah, I know I could have snuck in and stolen the thing and not, uh, not talk to him at all. I know that that was an option. Like, I kind of pieced that together when I walked in there and it was sitting on his desk. So I could have just broken in, taken it, and left. But then I wouldn't have all this side content. Oh, there's other calibrators in the world. Oh! Well, that wasn't made obvious. So that's a little more irritating. Press the button. Oh, even better. The couple files have gone subject without raising alarms. It was recent. Uh, bad day. Okay. Okay, so I got a code for an apartment somewhere. Alright. Let's get up onto this building. How do we do that? The obvious way. Mm -hmm. Standing on now? Good. Just uh, some traditional beanie. Oh, that dude's super dead. Technically, I never met him before. I did, however, meet a doctor who looks just like him in Alaska. In that clinic I told you about? His name then was McFadden. Christ, Adam. What exactly oh. happened? Oh, what is this? Ooh! I got a TYM val vault card. And you in that clinic? I don't know. I was in the coma ward. It was run by the World Health Organization. 
facility 451. Can you dig into it? Of course. I'm going to search this box. Oh, is that one of the ways I could have gotten one of the regulators? Is this literally like... Okay. One of four? Wait, do I need multiple regulators in order to be able to do more stable unlocks? No, so I just need I just need one of them. And I went for the easiest one, which now oh one of four key cards. Oh gotcha. Right, but I assume in these vaults I probably can get one of these regulators. As to which vault it is, I don't know, but Whatever, it's fine. I don't mind doing some of this runaround stuff. Like it's it's more side content, whatever. And I mean, no matter how this game wants to try and play it. Um uh, Oh, it is the Tai Young Medical Vault? Well pfft. Uh where how the hell do I get to this goddamn thing? There we go. Um, it's fine. Uh, surveillance package. Okay, so she's surveilling someone. Mm, something about that. Operation compromise. Visitors public domain. Uh, okay, so she was this dude's protection. Didn't really pan out for you. Yeah, well, okay, yeah, so uh, you're saying it's totally fine. I just find it so if you scour the world enough, you could basically skip that mission. That's kind of the Deus Ex MO. Like, that's the, that is the whole thing with Deus Ex, is you can, if you want, the more exploration you do, the more stuff you get in terms of information and options and stuff like that. Like, the number of times, even in the Udalek thing, where it's like, I get through a place, oh, look, there's a vent, where did that go? Oh, it was a totally other way to get here and stuff like that, the game prides you on that kind of exploration. Or, or rewards you. So yeah, if I had known that I could get more than one of those regulators, if there was even an inclining that I could get more than one of those regulators, um, I probably wouldn't have done that. Or I would have told the guy where the, where the hell to go. But... We're in it now as we are, so. Uh. Attempts it. Okay. Okay, cool. Uh. Okay. This dude's talking about all the fun stuff. That's us, right? 698843. Oh, okay. Nope, never mind. Hmm. Oh yes, this thing. Oh, there we go. What do you got for me? Uh, breach software, cool. And crit trip, cool. And a confidential medical report. Hey, look, it's us. I'm a master felonist, apparently. It's fun. I do like this, this space-saving table format, though, gotta say. I am a fan of this. The arms are a little high, that's a little wild, but otherwise. Remind Pokemon Freak, have you actually played? Uh, have you played other Deus Ex games? No. Okay, that's fair. Uh. Oh, so I have to break into Miller's office as a thing. Okay. Yeah, let's go talk to Smiley because we're right here. Kind of weird that I can just walk into the shop at nighttime. 
It's not really a nighttime kind of thing. Make the best of it, he said. All right, let's talk to Smiley. Rebreak into Miller's office. I love when games lock you down so that you can't jump um, on elevators because it screws everything up. Yeah, talk to Smiley. Come on. Oh, hey. <laughs> Checking my progress. Really, I said it would be done when it's done. You can't rush these things, Adam. Excellence takes time. Right. So... Well, I was right. Am I good or am I good? Oh, good. You fixed the picture. What did you find? Oh, just some isolated fragments from what looks like Bond's timing mechanism. And get this. It's a standing. Stanning. The bomb's timing mechanism was a wristwatch? Well, to address your incredulous tone, a mechanical timing mechanism is not as silly as it sounds. Security scanners can detect anything with a suspicious electronic circuit, so using a low-tech solution is really clever. Sure. Stanic watches are custom-made locally. I think I'll pay the shop a visit. Hmm, it's probably closed. Let's see if I can find you a second option. Nomad Stanek, founder and owner of the store lives in the Davnia Vod district near Pilgrim Station. That's Putnik Nadraji in Czech, I, I think. Building number 96, second floor. Thanks, I'll check it out. Great, let me know how it goes. Um, okay. I just want to point out, I could just break into that store. Like, that's... That's so not a thing I need to concern myself about. <laughs> I love this long elevator so they can reload the map outside. Oh shit. What just exploded? Whoa. Uh, How many times do I have to say it? The hell just exploded? I don't know what just exploded. I mean, yes, a bomb, but yes. I'm trying to find out specifically what exploded. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. The store. Hey, nosy. That shop is closed. I can see that. What happened? You must have upset someone. Bogs, valleys, who knows? But uh, buildings don't just spontaneously erupt into flames. There's always a reason. I'm looking for Nomad Stanek. Sure you are. So, is this official? I know the old man's past would finally catch up with you. Who are you with? Local? National? I want to ask him a few questions. Oh, sure you do. Sure you do. Just picking an old clockmaker's brain, right? You found a watch and you want to know what it's worth. 
Let me guess. It's your hub, right? Right. Anyway, you won't find him in that ruin. He must have fallen behind on his payment. Did you see what happened to the shop? I see everything. And what happened? This little accident is clearly a message to Nomad. When you borrow money, pay it back. Is this Stanek? That'd be a fun twist if that was actually him. said something about his past finally catching up with him. Playing dumb, hmm? As if you don't already know all of this. The demonstrations, the sabotage. They used to call it accident. Now they call it terror. What was he protesting? Everything. Anti-globalization, the oil industry, boycotts, sit-ins. A real agitator. Hmm. Any idea where I can find him? Oh, well, Prague's a big city. Might be anywhere. I could spend days searching. I mean, I know where his apartment is, bud. Yeah, I see where this is going. Listen, I'm providing a service here. It's only right I get compensated. You know what I mean? This is important, sir. I need to find Stanek before something bad happens. Are you threatening me? You can't go around threatening people just because I'm an influential guy around here. I know a lot of sensitive mm -hmm, information. Mm -hmm. I can tell. Someone like you knows everything that happens in the area, don't they? Fingers on the pulse of the city, right? Exactly. People need to know. They come to me. And they treat me with the respect I deserve. You know what I mean? Well, I need your help. Couldn't do it without you. I can't go into details, but you'd be doing a huge service to the city. Maybe even the world. The world, huh? I knew it! I knew I'd hit on something eventually. Yeah, I, I also like Jensen's, like, ugh, fine, uh, animation. The street from the Red Queen. The Red Queen, got it. Oh, hey, we gotta go by there anyways. Smiley, Stanek's shop was torched. Dead end? No, I spoke to a local who says that Stanek went to a bar in the Red Light District, across from the Red Queen. I'm heading there now. We have a couple of agents in that district watching this valley now. I'll send them over. Copy that. Oh, I could have just stolen the wine from there and given it to him. another way to get into that room I guess Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Where am I? Yeah, let's go ha bust into Miller's place again. This is 
right here. Uh, okay. Former SAS. Military life will make a neat freak out of anyone. If he's got secrets in there, Adam, they'll be well hidden. Everyone's got to tell. I just need to know more about him to understand his. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. I mean, we've kind of done this. Oh. There's key card. Something, Alex. Miller's NSN access card. He must have left it behind when he logged into his second computer. His second computer? Anything incriminating on it? Haven't checked it yet. But I'm starting to think the only way we'll yes. get more is by hearing all of that NSN conversation. Shit, man, that's risky. But we may have to. Why? You find something on VersaLife? It ain't good. Meet me in the small courtyard near TF-29. I'll explain. Okay, so top down, I guess. break in oh thanks for the three multi-tool paid for itself okay now oh, that's the one I wanted Interesting. He has uh, a thing at the Palisade. I mean, I broke into literally all of them, so whatever he has up there is long gone. But <laughs> good to know that we could have done it another way. Excuse me. Okay, uh... Okay, so... Point of interest. One last favor. Oh yeah, that's actually by... Stanek, so let's just meet Vega. Here, TF-29. And then we can run over to the... Whatever the hell it's called. Hey, hope no one goes close to this. Sounded like the least cool thing to see. Oh, I just found a vent to open. Alex, you here? Hey, thanks for being quick. Didn't want to be seen hanging around by myself for too long in case you got held up. I can be a gentleman sometimes. You said you got something on VersaLife. Yeah, a couple of months back, a research assistant was found dead in the Rokaseka Beach facility. Special Projects Division. She was poisoned, just like Rucker. She. You got her name? Anik Norstad. Why? You know somebody there? Doesn't matter. Forget it. <laughs> Stand versa life, Adam. Back when I was flying for Bell Tower in Panama, I stumbled into deep shit with them. They're the reason I've got a target on my back. They told my bosses to kill me. If they're involved in this, we'll get them. We just need to know what this is. I'm gonna choose to trust Vega for now. Said it could prove Ark is being set up. The email on it reads like activation orders to me. Where'd he get it? Whose is it? I've got a suspect in mind, but nothing to prove it. Until I do, 
Can you get Janus and one of your juggernaut friends to backtrace the IP address? Yeah, man, no problem. Oh, yes, IP addresses. Those are infallible. The information we found on Norstat was buried deep. No police report, no autopsy. Just a footnote on an insurance claim calling it an industrial accident. She was working with dangerous pathogens, wasn't she? Supposedly. Janus thinks there's more to it. He's the one who found the report. Said it was off. Off how? Lots of blank spaces and missing details. Didn't really go into it. And you didn't think to ask, did you? Are you saying I fucked up? <laughs> I'm saying Janus thinks a lot of things. And somehow always manages to find the answer when nobody else can. You don't find that odd? I find it reassuring. The Collective has people everywhere gathering all kinds of intel. But Janus is what holds us together, helps us make sense of it. He picks the signal out of the static. And yet you've never met him. <laughs> Nobody meets Janus. Nobody even knows where he is, who he mm -hmm. is, hell even what he is. You get used to it after a while. For me, the key thing is what he finds. Norstat was poisoned, Adam, just like Rucker. Are we looking at some kind of bioweapon here? Miller's access card might help us find out. How? I don't follow you. NSN exchanges are stored in the system's cloud memory. If I log in as Miller using his access card, I might be able to play back more of that conversation he had with the bosses. Shit, Adam, this isn't like planting a bug. You have to actually use the chair for a while if anyone catches you. Mm hmm. It's a risk I'm willing to take. Is it? Your call. But I want to be plugged in and listening the whole time you're in there. Which should be fine because we still have the bug in there. Call me when you've accessed the machine. Now, where was that little phrase? This guy. I'm gonna crack this open. Sure takes me. Haha. <laughs> You're back on your computer. I don't want any problem. Okay, so uh we have to go with this, and we're just gonna call it tonight with that. Like I'm just gonna run there. Where the hell am I going? Oh, that's so far. Okay. A little to the left. I'm just gonna run this way until we can't no more. Disgusting. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Ah, the red light district. The our stool, cigar lounge, and the Red Queen. All right. Okay. Wait, can you open these? Why can you open these doors? Oh, okay. <sighs> okay. We are gonna save here for now. All right. And quit. Yep. Uh, nope, that's not one. There we go. Okay. Uh, and there's the frame drops again. It happens as soon as I quit the game. I don't know why. That's something weird. But that's re that is a reproducible way to make my frames drop, and I don't know why. But it's too late. I'm going to bed. So. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow with Murder by Numbers. Um, yeah, I like that Deus Ex actually giving me some real, like, 
I don't trust any of these people. At all. So. That's fun. Uh, yeah. But it's already 1218, so I'm going to bed. So, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, and... Yeah. Stay safe, have fun, and I uh, will see you later.